Tom, <coughs> there's a saying, it's uh, not how you start, it's how you finish. Yes. Could that be applied to tonight's game? Well, I would say, yeah. I, did, I would say it definitely applies to this game as far as we did, we started, I guess, well, let's call it slowly. And, uh, you know, and it seemed that every time we took a step forward, uh, we'd take two steps back. We, you know, we, we did start slowly. We tied the game up, as I recall. Believe me, <laughs> with that many goals scored, I have to double check here. But, uh, and then, boom, we allowed uh, a third goal, you know, allowed them to take the lead just before the period ended. And uh, if I'm not mistaken, we did the same in the second. We tied the game up just when every, everyone thinks uh, we're going into the room to uh, come back, you know, with a tie game in the third period. Bang, they score again. So it was almost, uh, you could say, a comedy of errors out there tonight. And it was almost uh, what we would say last shot wins, as in the last shot on the goal is the team that's going to win. But uh, then we fortunately uh, scored a couple quick ones and we jumped in front. But, but when it was 7-6, I'm thinking, you know, I, I look back at our game last week against Manchester where we played solid defensively and we were able to hold on to a lead and, you know, go from there. But that didn't happen here tonight. They found a way to get back in the game. I thought, all in all, defensively, we were atrocious tonight. And I expressed that to our players, and they know. And hopefully, uh, you know, that happens to, I would say, it, you know, happens to every team. Like the Belfast-Glasgow game was eight to six, I believe. You know, so that's not only us. And uh, the other night it was a 9-4 game, I think, with Sheffield and Glasgow again. So, I mean, it happens. And but the when you when it's all said and done, it's really good to come out of it on the winning side. Yeah, yeah. yeah I mean, that that's obviously been the, the important outcome tonight. It's that two huge points. Two huge points again tonight. Absolutely huge. And then with Manchester and Glasgow not winning tonight. You know, that gives us, you know, we're right there. Yep. So. <coughs> Fans obviously love to see goals oh. and plenty of goals. Coaches perhaps not so much. So do you take very much out of tonight's game at all or do you just write it off as a one-off and, and move, a, move on? I hope it's one and done. And uh, we're not looking, uh, you know, I'm not really uh, all that excited about uh, giving up that many goals. Not my kind of game. <laughs> and... But I'll take the, the win, and that's really the, the positive side of it. Yeah. Yeah. And obviously a long journey tomorrow and a tough opponent in uh, Guildford. Again, we're looking for points. Well, you know, we're looking for points. Uh, house money, you might <laughs> say, uh, right now. I mean, on a long road trip, we're looking for some, uh, one point, two points. And so that with a, it's great to win the night, and today, tomorrow's a new day. Tomorrow's a new game, and uh, you know we'll have a couple of changes, I think, for tomorrow, and away we go.